how to diagnose a faulty regulator slash rectifier on a motorcycle. I've got, my, I've got my multimeter connected to my battery. The battery seems healthy. It's 13.5 volts, which is sort of like, it's a healthy battery. But when I switch the motor on, and you'll see that this number, the voltage will jump up to 19 volts, and the engine will start seizing. It will start uh, running badly, roughly, simply because there's too much voltage going through the system and something's giving way. It's simply misfiring, there's something going bad, so I reckon it's a faulty regulator rectifier. Let's rectify it. The rectifier is behind the pillion foot peg, so I'll just take it off. That's the rectifier there. Normally they've got fins on them, just for cooling, but um, this one doesn't. It's just a standard Yamaha Drago rectifier. As luck would have it, I've actually got a second bike, so what I'll do is I'll take I'll simply swap the rectifiers around and hopefully this one is not faulty. The plugs, it's a simple plug in, look at this. Three on this side, one on this side, and this should just simply plug into the harness. A working regulator's in. Let's start it up, see how it goes. I'm expecting something 15 or less, I'll be happy with. If not, I'll just order a new one. fine to me. Now I've got no excuse not to go to work on Monday. Shit. Thanks for watching.